Oh, so it's basically a clip of me closing my losses on Friday for my setup. I thought I was gonna play out on Monday. I was pretty confident in it. I was very confident in that setup. Hence why, like, I ended up like risking as much as I risk, and as a result, I lose, you know, half of the account. You know. Um. Look, one thing that's getting in this game is the losses, and like, this is just a message to myself. I guess to anyone who needs to hear it. One thing in this game that's guaranteed is the losses. You are guaranteed to flip and take an L in this game. And the only way you can like be bigger than those losses if is if you apply proper risk management. I've been feeling sort of shite this whole weekend. Saturday, yesterday I was feeling shite. Like during whole the process, I'm feeling shite. But I'm trying to be bigger than my emotions. But I'm looking at like that I can't. I'm like, dog. As much as I know better, it's hard for me to do better right now. And finally, when the setup showed me that hey, I'm more present, and I was like, okay, cool, let me just close then. Then I closed, and we get left with the balance that I left with, and now I'm just dealing with the repercussions of that. But yeah, that's the update. That's the result of the of the perfect setup not failing for me personally. You know, perfect setups are gonna fail. We know that for sure. But you wanna fail and still continue doing the same thing. And I'm at a position where I'm where I failed and like I don't want to do the same thing but I also understand that it's not the best decision I'm making right now I can tell you that's for sure it's not the best decision I'm making the best decision is to continue same trading and and risk problem that's the perfect that's like the ideal decision but as I think about it I'm gonna tell them about it and hopefully I'll come to like my senses Cause right now I really do still feel like very emotional, you know. Yeah.